Too long, didn't watch. Um, the Pixel Company have decided to make a new game called Adam's Family Mystery Mansion coming soon within this year. My guess is going to be coming around October of this year, around the same time as the movie like they did with another game they've released. And this video just basically talks a little bit about the press release that was announced, uh, delaying like all the stuff that we know so far about this game, and more so the question of whether or not you guys like to see me play through this game. If you are interested, you can leave a comment down below and I will think of this to my conclusion, but if you are interested in seeing more of the press release as well as information on this game, uh, just stay tuned during the video and we'll talk a little bit more about the Adams Family and all that stuff. So, so with that being said, I guess enjoy the video. up a little bit while in the 80s and 90s you probably have heard this tune before and probably know what this is this is a bizarre video for me to do because I tend not to really do stuff like this but I found something out down the ether while looking for stuff for this content and I came across some news that I figured I might as well pass on to you the viewers seeing how you might be interested in this moving forward for those of unaware, I am Grimokin, but you probably have been watching me or people have been subscribing to me for my series on Goosebumps Horror Town, where I take a look at Pix Owl's game that was released back uh, 2017 in October, but officially in last year around May. But why am I making a video like this and what is with the title? Well. As I was looking into the on the internet, as I usually do, I came across some information that they've decided to release on their public information. Did you know, Goosebumps is based off of a scholastic property. It is a book that's been made a bunch of times around the world in different languages. And I think it sold like 3.5 million... I'm not going to quote that, but... You get the idea. This this book series has been pretty much long, and I've been a fan of it since I was grew up with it back in the 90s. But, as you can probably guess from my channel name, from my look, you can see I'm kind of the guy who likes creepy stuff. Especially stuff that came from my nostalgia. So, lo and behold, later on, earlier this year, around April, there was a tease trailer that was dropped that basically showed that there was a new movie coming out known as The Addams Family. And that little jingle I did was indeed the theme to The Addams Family. Now, The Addams Family itself, I believe, was made by a guy by the name of Charles Adams. And the idea of this was way back in the 1930s. He made this comic, not comic, but more like images for newspapers where it just showed his bizarre family. Um, to get a good idea what this is, if you know the monsters, this is basically the same thing. We're basically, just imagine a creepy family full of ghouls. Well, not really ghouls, but you know, like goth people. People who like the, the, like the opposite of things. And this is the family that does it. Like, this is the bizarre, weird family that lives in the haunted house. But they're not evil. They're just your average Joes. They just... You know, they like the opposite of stuff. So it's like if you give them a, uh, a, a machine gun or something like that, they'd be like, oh, wow, cool, thank you very much. Well, other people will think of like, what is wrong with you? Anyways, regardless of that, I'm rambling on. So why am I talking about the Adams Family? Well, as I stated, as of today, well, Friday, but they announced this Thursday, there is a new thing coming to the game market in Pixel. Pixel has been making games as of late. They did Snoopy's Town Tale. I mean, like, they first start off with Garfield, then they moved on to Snoopy's Town Tales, then they get the Goosebumps games, which you're all familiar with, and then I think as recently as this year, they did Wonder Park, which is based off of the animation of the same name, and there's going to be a TV spinoff with that. Now, those other games, although I do play them, I don't 
Oh, and then they also did the um, treehouse, uh, loud house, treehouse thing. Now, although I do play those and I do record them, I don't think for the purpose of this channel people are more interested in seeing stuff like that. But this next announcement seems more intriguing, and you might be already cluing in on what's going on here. But as of the 26th of July, they made the announcement, or I should say the parent company, Anima, um, Animica Brands, announced the official mobile game for the upcoming MGM films, The Addams Family, called The Mysterious Mansion. I'm going to go into the website pretty soon, but here's the gist of what this is. So, the Animica Brands is excited to announce that Pixel will be developing the Addams Family Mystery Mansion official mobile game. In the conjuring with the new MGM animated film, The Addams Family Family Movie, or The Addams Family Movie, coming out in October of this year, which I think is October the 11th. Details about the mobile game here, which I'm about to show off, and then the full press release, which I'm going to show off now. So, this is the website which showed off, you know, you get the image from the movie. So this is basically on keen to what they did with the Wonder Park as well as Snoopy's Town Tales. But, you know, as you can see, here's what I believe is what the look is going to be for this. So anyways, Adam's Family Mystery Mansion is the name of the thing. It is going to be in the Apple Store and the Google Store for the looks of it. This is all about stationary images, by the way. There's no real, like, other images besides. I am going to link two images that's here, off here. Um, the Adams Family's back, ready to create the kookiest mansion? Can't wait. Neither can we. Sign up for the email update. Well, you know, when the game's available, so, you know. As you can see, I put mine already on here. If you want to email me, there it is. I link the information onto my site on Google, like, not Google, but... On my official page, so you have the email link there. Not much too big. I think this is a picture off of the film, so there's nothing there. You get a good look at their kind of animation style, so it's a bit of the 3D-esque look. So that's kind of interesting to see. Creepy and kooky. Something mysterious is afoot. The Adams Family Mansion is suddenly empty, and they need your help to reunite the family and refurbish their house. Or refurbish their home. Collect your favorite characters from the movie and expand your car catalog, catalog, catalog of spooky furniture and decorations. Learn more. And it, there's no link here, so it's just stationary at this point. However, there is something interesting about this that I was going to mention here. Is the fact that... Okay, I might as well, while, while I'm thinking of what I'm about to say, might as well look at the key features. Alright, collect all the characters from the upcoming movie, most likely anything above the lore. Uh, expand the house and unlock new content with every level. So, again, typical, if you've played any Pixel game, it's typical fanfare. Decorate and personalize your mysterious mansion. Craft and spook a craft spooky and funny items to meet the family's needs so basically typical like craft items drop items that kind of thing you've seen here enjoy the Adams family's charm and humor throughout our original story so again typical fanfare these are the two images that they're kind of showing off so I might as well kind of get a quick good look at them real quick very nice I can't zoom in so that's that's the size you got so we're gonna be dealing with that unfortunately right now so let's move away from that for some reason these are the only two images by the way there's there's nothing new it's just these two so you get a good idea of how this is going to look so live an original Adam story and create the cookiest mansion so you can see a bit of the, the original characters are here from the film. So we knew that the Adams in the films are going to be in this thing here. You get the idea of how this game is going to look and feel for the most part, kind of. Um, some things of note to be interest is that there is this icon here. I'm not sure what this is going to be about, per se. It could be like what they do with the Horror Town and Scares or collecting scare points, but... We'll have to wait and see how they're going to deal with this. This, of course, inventory items. Uh, interesting to note, it looks like the Atom coin... Like It looks like there's like an Atom coin here. I guess this is the um, normal 
freemium currency and then the real currency are these giant diamonds, the red diamonds. Now, of course, this image is, although it looks pretty new, this is not final. It can, the sub, things are subject to change. So these are just the only things we get right now. So things are always going to be changing. And even when the game's released, it's going to adapt like other games have done before. In fact, here, come back often for updates and you get some more items they've decided to kind of show off they have. So you get, you get the idea. It looks and sounds like to me, and then you get the, you know, the copyright holders, the parent company, the actual company that makes in the game, and then the actual people who own the rights to the Adams family in the film. Um, what's interesting about this game is it kind of reminds me of, there was a Family Guy Halloween update, I believe this was in the third year. They did this thing where you would go to a mansion or a haunted, uh, hot haunted mansion hotel run by um, what's the from um, something wood, Mr. Woods, and um, what was interesting about that was that it was basically like you lock different areas and every week you unlock the new area. So it, it feels like the environment this time around, instead of unlocking land, you're actually unlocking more space to this room mansion. So it's interesting to see how this will play out in the long run. Now, as far as the press release goes, this whole press release thing kind of explains the whole gist of the agreement. So... The Animacan brand, Corporation Limited, you know, basically the Animacan brands or the company, is pleased to advise that its whole owned subsidiary, Pixel Incorporated, or just Pixel, is developing the Adams Family Mysteries Mansion, or The Game, an official mobile game based on the highly anticipated anime movie of the Adams Family. The game is made possible by the incorrect the Interactive Licensing Agreement, or the agreement between Pixel and MGN Interactive Inc., or MGN. The game will launch globally for both iOS and Android devices near the end of the current quarter, meaning that you're looking at around October. Sorry for the jump cut, I just basically yawned there for a second. Apologies, but anyways. The game will launch globally for both iOS and Android devices near the end of the current quarter. We're looking at probably around the same time as the movie coming out in October the 11th. The Adams Family is an upcoming MGM animated comedy horror based on the franchise spawned by the comic by Charles Adams, first published in 1938. In addition to the comic, the franchise includes books, films, television series, animation, video games, and musicals. The Adams Family will open in cinemas worldwide on the 11th October 2019, as far as we know. The agreement grants Pixel a non-exclusive license to use the property and assist and assets of the Adams family to develop, distribute, and monetize the Adams Family Mystery Mansion mobile game for a term lasting through. And here's the interesting thing: December 31st, 2024. So it's a five to four year contract. Basically, this is just typical fanfare. Usually, contracts last between three to five years. And as they explain here, unless renewed by both parties. So this is just like they basically allow to do this up until the end of 2024. If the game is successful and it still runs, then they can agree to re-extend the license and then have that kind of there. And um, they've stated with all the other games they have so far, the agreements are up and good until uh, 2022. So... If the game ends up dying off and they don't have anything to renew it to 24 or until 2022, then the games will end up dying off like what we've seen from other companies like how Marvel Avengers Academy died after three years because it wasn't making enough product or money to justify keeping it. Um, anyways, the game will be free to play with options of in-app purchases or IAP, which is which is typical at this point. Uh, MGN will receive a portion of revenue generated by the game as royalties. The game will invite players to help Marissa Gomez to reunite the rest of the family and refurbish their home. 
Through chapters and missions driven by the original story and winning dialogue, players will collect their favorite characters from an upcoming movie, The Addams Family, as well as furbish and decorate the, fam the famous Addams Mansion. More information about the game can be found at the official website, AddamsFamily.game, including updates and development available of the Addams Family Mystery Mansion, and, and then it just goes forward to talk about who Pixel is and then what are what is, you know, medical brands. Um, so long story short with this is there's a new game coming out, uh, for the Adams Family. I'm rather intrigued to see how this will go. And, um, as of right now, I'm very intrigued in playing it and maybe even showing this as a second part to my channel. So not only will you have Goosebumps Horror Town, but you might even have the Adams Family. As we've seen with Pexile before, they are very good when it comes to making source material, and like they've stated, the Adams Family, although this is a movie base, does not mean that they can't work with what they got. They have lots of characters within this lore that they can use for the game, so it's not like they don't have anything to work off of. There were movies, games, animation series, so there's a lot to work with when it comes to the IP segment. So. If the game turns out well, and they do make money back, and they, you know, get some good revenue when it comes to actual limited time updates, I don't see why not that this game can live a little bit long life. If it doesn't, then the game just doesn't get updated and it's just left for dead. So, my question to you is, are you interested in seeing me play through the Adams Family Mystery Mansion? Is this a game that would be of your interest to see me kind of play through? If the answer is yes, then I will find my time to try to record and make videos on the subject matter. As well as with Goosebumps Horror Town. But if you guys rather just have me focus on Goosebumps, then that's fine too. But I figured you guys watching this video may be interested in knowing that this game is coming out. So... Expect this game to come around Halloween ish. I don't know if it's going to be officially there, but it's going to be around there. So that's about it for the announcement. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing how this game turns out because I was just thinking about this, and sure enough, the, the company just tends to just grab them IPs and making stuff out of them. So we'll just have to wait and see what they do with them. But um, as of right now, that's about it. So thanks for listening to this announcement, and uh, yeah, I'll see you later.